Natasha, congratulations. Thank I suppose this is just about the perfect day for you today. Yeah, it's great. You know, we want to do well in this competition, so we're through to the semi finals. I'm over the moon, and to get all four goals as well as a centre forward, yeah, it's, it's brilliant for me. And a first, I don't think I've ever scored four in a game, so yeah, I'm buzzing. I was just going to ask you that as my next question, actually. Yeah. Is that the first time you scored four against a team of this quality? Yeah, definitely of this quality, in the, you know, in the, in the top league of the FAWSL. I mean, it's a great achievement for me and for the team to get through to the semis. Like I said, I'm over the moon, so hopefully now we can really kick on and have a strong end to our season. And the team really stepped it up after the break, didn't they? After quite an even first half. Yeah, we did. You know, the first half was really even. How oh, I went to do an interview with her doing that vibe. <laughs> yeah, we should just say that Kate Longhurst is uh, unsurprisingly uh, pulling his <laughs> We'll yeah, carry on. It was a really even first half. I think the second goal was really important. It probably wasn't, you know, the nicest of my finishes, but it was an important one. And I think after that, then we were quite comfortable. And like I said, to to have got all four. I think then we managed the game quite well. And, you know, Bristol, they're a, they're a terrific team. You know, they've, have, they've had a hard season like we have. But, you know, they didn't stop till the end. They kept fighting and showed great team spirit. And, you know, I wish them all the best. And out of the 4-2 with your left foot, I should point out. Yeah, you know, I need to trust in my left foot a little bit more. And I was pleased with my finishes today, really composed and, and under pressure. Because, you know, it's a high-pressure game that, you know, we can't win the league now. So this is the competition that we want to do well in. And I think the girls were really mature in the way that we played today. And we never really stopped believing that we could get a positive result here. And there were good performances all around the team. When there, I thought Katie Zellum had a really good game. With her. I was really impressed with Ingrid Ryland at yeah. left back. Ingrid's been growing the last couple of games. She's got a few runouts now. She's struggled with injuries this season, unfortunately, like a lot of our team. So, you know, she's really played well today. And um, against Man City, she had a strong game. And like you said about Katie Zellum, a young kid coming through. We've got some real talent in this team. So hopefully, like I said, we can have a strong end of the season and really look to get everyone back fully fit. And we've got a great squad and hopefully we can strengthen next season as well and really kick on. Another player who works so hard up front is Rosie White. Yeah. She must be a great fall for you and great to play alongside. Yeah. And she was unlucky not to score. As Mary made a great save, didn't she, from that flick? I've loved playing with Rosie, to be honest, since she's come here at Liverpool. She's the type of player that I love to play with. She's intelligent. She sees my run. She's comfortable on the ball. You know, she can play out wide and play just off the forward. So for me, you know, it's no coincidence why I've been scoring a lot more goals since she's come to the team. And like I said, I thank her for that. And I've really been enjoying my football the second half of the season. We know that Birmingham and Notts County are definitely through. Obviously, we don't know about the fourth game yet. Any preference at all for the court, for the semi-finals? No, not really. Mm. Every game is a tough game, to be honest, in women's football now. So you'd be stupid to think that, that it's not going to be a tough game. But we're just absolutely over the moon that we're through to the semis. We've got two weeks off now because of international break. So hopefully we can regroup, you know, really kind of rest and recover now. And exciting times for us, hopefully. You mentioned all the injuries and the fact it has been a tough season to go yeah. with that. But it's going to be a nice end. You've got Champions League coming yeah. up, a cup semi-final, and who knows a cup final. So still plenty to play for. There is, you know. And like I said, obviously, we're really disappointed not to have retained our title. But, you know, we've been back-to-back -back champions, which is an unbelievable achievement. And we'll come back stronger. And like you said, we're still in two competitions, which is brilliant. Mm. Champions League. And hopefully we can really do well in this Continental Cup. Well, we wish you the best of luck with that. Congratulations again, Tash. Fantastic. Cheers. Achievement of the day to score four goals against the WSL one team. We wish you, as I said, the very best of luck. Hope you get the joy you want. And thanks for taking the time Cheers. and coming and talking to us right now. Thank Cheers. You. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Thanks.